Are you on death job because you did something wrong? Just like a destiny job, so you did something wrong in the field and they won't put you back out there? Is that why you're here? Every time I go to the courthouse, I wear my cute little waist trainer thing to make me look super skinny. And every time I go to the courthouse, they have to wand me. What's a wand? This is a wand. Notice how she doesn't have to take off her necklace. So the wand is actually a metal detector, and it takes the place of the one you have to walk through. So if I already had to be wanted for my cute little waist thing, why did they make me take all these necklaces off? Now normally, I don't argue over by the metal detectors, but this time I was having trouble unlatching two of these. So I called for the supervisor. And guess what? The supervisor took the side of the deputy and said it was policy. Even though I was being wanted, I had to take everything metal off. But why was I still wearing my, my waist trainer then? So I figured if it took me 10 minutes to take them off, I was gonna take a few minutes to put them back on. And here's what happened. Yeah, you're eating at twenty one dollars an hour, aren't you? Monkey jobs. You got sixty dollars sitting right here every hour. And sixty on the other side. So it's 120 an hour just sitting around. Does it really take three of y'all to run this machine? It must be a hard job, it must be really tough. It looks really hard. Why don't they just outsource and get some, some minimum wage people to $21 an hour people? to give a bucket, one person look at the screen, one person give the bucket back. Monkey see, monkey do. Monkey job. Hmm. Oh, <clears throat> see, if I didn't take my necklaces off, I wouldn't be here like messing with y'all now. 
yourself? When's the last time you violated somebody's rights? When's the last time you handcuffed somebody and beat them up? When's the last time you shot at a, a, a citizen? Are you on death's job because you did something wrong? Is this like a destiny job so you did something wrong in the field and they won't put you back out there? Is that why you're here? What's your favorite part of the jail? Oh, impersonating people. How come there's so many people getting beat up over there? Why do you have 40 deaths a year over there? Why are they not in compliance right now? Yeah, the jail wasn't in compliance right now. Did y'all know that? The jail's out of compliance. Did y'all know that? It's been since March. for 35 years until this new uh, sheriff came around. Do you know Baby was born up there and they didn't know it for two days? Baby would have lived had they known it. A woman gave birth while alone in a Fort Worth jail cell Sunday, May 17th. The Tarrant County Sheriff's Office says they knew the woman was pregnant and they were having staff check on her regularly, but she did not immediately tell staff after giving birth. Yeah, sit down, sit down, sit down. You've been working really hard. Go sit down, sit down. Yeah, there you go, sit down. You've been working hard, you need a break. Oh, oh, oh here comes a customer. The guy's gotta get up now. Oh wait, she probably has a magic badge and doesn't have to go through. She probably works here. Oh no, she, she doesn't. Oh yeah, she does. Oh, oh, she beeped. Oh, she beeped. You're not gonna watch her? So it's okay, what if she has a gun in that bag? How do you know she doesn't? How do you know that she doesn't have a gun in that bag? How do you know? You know, it's usually the employees that come back and, and shoot up the place, right? You knew that, right? It's employees. I know you're afraid of guns because you got on one of them vests. So you might be, should be afraid of her because she probably has a gun in her bag. Sit down, you need a break. You need a break. Sit down. Sit down, you need a break. There you go. Sit down. Sit down, you need a break. Come on, you need a break. You've been working really hard. There you go. That's your tax dollars at work.